to Mrs. Greenthumb. Okay, this will be for my potatoes raised bed. And we're starting out with four two by sixes. And we're gonna use a couple one to two two by twos. Okay, we have about a two and a half foot stake. We're gonna put the stakes in, as you can see, at each corner is two stakes, and then we're drilling two screws to each stake, and we'll be doing this in all four corners. Okay, now it's all built. It didn't take that long, maybe 45 minutes of that. And it is, it's a very simple one that we're doing here. Um, and if you can see, they're, they're pegged in all four corners. So that was four two by sixes and about one two by two. And that was for my potato garden. The next thing I'll show you next, we're gonna dig up the ground here to get rid of all the weeds and the grass. And then we're gonna lay some hay. So it really is a simple thing that I'm going to do for this potato. I'm gonna call it the raised bed potato garden, something like that, I'm not sure what the name is. And um, so, and we have another one going next door doing the same thing. It's gonna be roughly about eight by eight. And I will be putting tomatoes in that vent, but that's going to need some topsoil and other things put to it. But this strictly is just dug up, and we're going to show you the next step when we get to it. Digging up the ground, and then we're just going to lay hay. And I'm going to let it sit for a little bit because it's too cold to put out for the potatoes. I have to wait till May because I don't want potatoes here. It's too cold. Uh, they'll probably rot out if I put the potatoes out too long. So I have to wait till warmer weather, which is about the 2nd of May, where I start putting all my garden plants out. Vegetables, flowers, everything. All right, there's the start of it, and let's get digging. Whew, it's hot out here today. Though it's not a big section, it's certainly time consuming to dig it up. You can see I'm out of breath here. But it takes a little bit of time. You have to take a break and then get back to it. But uh, yeah, I'm getting it done. As you can see, it's all dug up and now we're just raking it up. And I'm gonna do the next step pretty soon. Alright, the next step is the two, we have two bales of hay, but actually we have four, so two are going to go on the bottom, and I'm saving some for putting the potatoes next, and then another set of hay over top of that, but you will not see this in this video, because it's too early to plant my potatoes, I can't do that till a second with the May, but I wanted to get this video up so you could see what we were working on. Okay, we got all the hay separated, we're going to wait, that's going to compress down, we're going to put the potatoes in, like I said, next, and then put another layer to two bales on top of that. And we'll be totally finished. But right now it's set for the potatoes, which won't be going until the second week of May, like I said before. Thank you so much for watching, and bye for now. Have a great day.